to my channel i am back and as you all know like i always say it's been a minute <laughs> well this time it hasn't been that long i'm usually gone for like a year right well i'm here and this video is long 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 overdue i have so many girls that inbox me and dm me and ask me how i diffuse my hair how do i keep my volume and my definition so it's here for you guys i finally got a video for you guys and it's here and this video is strictly on diffusing i do not show you how i style my hair or any of that but i will tell you what products that i use so what i did was i deep conditioned with curls uh cashmere and caviar if you guys received curl box you would have gotten one of these in your curl box so i deconditioned with that for like half an hour i rinsed that out and then I, I shampooed with the cashmere, where is it? <laughs> cashmere and caviar hair bath. So this is like a shampoo. And this product literally left my hair feeling like I put conditioner in it. So if you haven't tried this, you need to get you some because it cleanses and conditions like at the same time. So and then after that, I use, I rinse that out and then I conditioned with Natural Mother's. Blue sea kelp and coconut water. This stuff is really good. A lot of people are raving about this. I'm almost done with this. And I love the whole line of this. I'm actually pretty much done with like the mousse and stuff. And the shampoo and the conditioner I'm almost done with. So get you some of this. Not your mother's. It's really, really, really good. So I conditioned with this for like five to seven minutes. And then I rinsed it out. And then I styled with mousse has been my favorite thing lately. So I styled with Giovanni. Too chic, what is it? What uh, this is tangerine and papaya butter ultra volume. So, this is good stuff. Get you some of this, and then I use the curls cashmere and caviar hair gel. Good stuff. It smells this stuff smells so good, you guys. Like, for real, if you, you've gotten a curl box with this stuff, y'all need to get up on it. It's really, really, really good. Anyhow, enough talking, and let's get to the video, and thanks for sticking with me, guys, and I love y'all, and if you guys are new, please hit that subscribe button, thumbs me up, thumbs me down, whatever you want. I still love y'all, <laughs> and thanks for watching. See y'all. Okay, take two. Oh, <laughs> I thought I pressed the camera. So now what I do is, is I remove my diffuser piece, like that. Then I turn it back on and I go in and I blow dry.
So once I'm completely done, I take this black cast of miracle oil, which is so good. It gives me a great shine and it doesn't weigh my hair down or anything. So I just take the cap off. I pour a little bit. You really only need a little bit. And it does work. So here's that. And I rub it. And I rub it on my hair like that. Rub it on my hair like that. And then I scrunch. It smells really good. You should have gotten one of these in a, a curl box. I'm not sure which one. But I definitely received mine out of a curl box. So those of you who receive curl box will know what I'm talking about. So once my hair, once I add a little shine. Y'all see that there, Brian? All right, and then you get your handy daddy pick. Don't mind my elongated curls right here. My hair is growing, so it's very much elongated. And I didn't add any protein. I just had my hair straight, so I didn't add any protein. So I think if I would have added some protein, it would have been more of a pop. But this, I look like I need to cut it, but I'm not. So what I do is I pick at the root. Handy daddy pick. Pick at the root all over. I lift up my hair and I pick. Trying not to touch my curls so I don't mess up the pattern. This is pretty much all that I do. And I just keep picking until I get to my desired point. And then I take my fingers and I rub my scalp all over. A nice massage, stimulating the castor oil that I already have on my fingers. And there we have it.